this is for Capricorn. This is your May 16th through the 31st reading here. This may or may not resonate with you. So however, take what it does and leave the rest. It is timeless. Whenever you get a Capricorn, you are meant to have it. Okay. This is for your rising sun, moon, Venus, cross watchers, and cuspers. Uh, gotta get this reading out because my battery is flashing. Batteries don't last all day anymore. What is wrong with these batteries? All right, Capricorn, let's see what's going on with your dominant energy. Uh, what does Spirit Source Energy want you to know for May 16th through the 31st? Spirit Source Energy, what do you need Capricorn to know? Spirit Source Energy, ooh, whoa, look at there. I'm feeling my say if, I'm feeling my say if. No, I'm just kidding, that's the star card. <laughs> I just wanted to say that because she was naked. <laughs> oh my gosh. Because <clears throat> that's how I be when I be feeling myself too. I be just like that, standing up there like what? <laughs> what? All right. Spirit Source Energy. What does Capricorn need to know? Spirit Source Energy about themselves in the week of 16th through the 31st. What overall energy is Around them, three of pentacles. Spirit source energy. What else does Capricorn need to know? What kind of spirit source energy? What else do you have? Oh, wait a minute, man. Why? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait one second. Turn her all energy. Queen of pentacles. Ooh, look how elegant. Look how elegant she looks with that pink on over yonder. That's what I'm talking about. Feeling yourself. I better get my battery. Hold on, y'all. Let me get my charger because this thing may go Do not lose anybody. I can finish this reading. Okay, Capricorn. I have to hurry up because I got to go to bed. I was sleepy. Very sleepy. And I got two more to do besides you. Oh my gosh. Let me get through this. Look at y'all coming up in here, feeling y'all self. You know, the storm is over. It has passed, baby. You feeling like this star. You have arrived. You like feeling yourself. You are like literally naked on this picture right here, okay? You got this wish fulfillment going on. You got the balance thing going on. You got a grip, baby, and the storm is over. And you are coming out, baby. You like, I'm coming out, coming. I won't work to know. I got to let it show. That's my theme song, actually. Diana Ross, I'm coming out. So see, you're coming out. There you go, Capricorn. Queen of Pentacles, you are looking sexy, feeling sexy. You have this balance in money and in, uh, in, in maintaining your uh, financial stability. You know, you're fertile, you're a resourceful, you know, like Mother Earth. You represent Mother Earth, you're, you're just resourceful. You have plenty, you know, uh, things going on for yourself that builds you financial uh, stability even, you know, and security. So you're not worried about anything. You know you got it going on, Capricorn, okay? This is the Three of Pentacles where, you know, there's a possible collaboration, you know, in the air. The Three of Pentacles, you're waiting for it to come in. You're waiting for, you know, with precision to, you know, to take aim and, and and shoot that bow, like direct that toward your goals. You're like aiming for your goals here, you know, looking with precision and clarity uh, with uh, things moving ahead. This is the Knight of Pentacles. With the Knight of Pentacles, you have a marriage offer and proposal, something sure that is coming in that is, you know, that's your sign. That's your like, okay, I'm here. We're really going to do this. We're going to get married. We're going to get this proposal going off the ground and, and have this serious talk, you know, about marriage. 
and and what are we going to do about it right so this is your knight of pentacles your marriage card your get out of single card <laughs> Capricorn, you got a, this is going to be my get out of single card, baby. Keep playing with me. I'm going to name all these damn tarots up in his damn deck. I ain't playing with y'all. Oh, my God. I'm so sleepy. I'm going to be silly in a minute. Okay. If y'all get silly, and, and y'all know why, because I'm tired. Look, I even got my robe on. Got out of the shower. I was like, okay, do these three more, because tomorrow I may not do any. <laughs> Here's the nine of swords coming in here. You are worrying and overthinking yourself. Need you to get out of your head. You know, boogeyman's in your head. You know, look at the boogeyman. Get out your head so the boogeyman can go away, please. This is you running away, trying to retreat, getting away from things that, you know, that bother you or that irritate you. This is your rest card. This is his time to take a freaking break, okay? A freaking break, okay? That's what this is. You know, time to move forward, get out of your head, get into your heart, take a break, relax, unwind, all that good stuff, all that very good, good, good stuff, okay? This is, like I said, this is your get out of single card, baby. Get the hell out of single <laughs> and get your ass married. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Let's see what these cards mean. Let's see what Clarify is going to do for us. Some justice, we hope. We hope. Don't we hope, Capricorn? Spirit source energy. What is this three of pinnacle about? Spirit source energy. Three of pinnacle about. What is this three of pinnacles about? Spirit source energy. Spirit source energy. What is this three of pinnacle about? There is the hierophant card. That is the marriage card. Spirit source energy. Got the victory too. What is the three of Whoa, Ace of Pentacle and juggling. Oh, Lord, oh, Lord, oh, Lord. Look at this Three of Pentacle. Y'all are thinking about this collaboration and this deal. There's an offer being extended to you, Capricorn, uh, from out of the universe, from out of the blue, from out of anywhere, baby. It needs to hit your hand. It just needs to hit your hand. That's what you're thinking. If I can just get this offer, if I can just get this off the ground, well, guess what? The Pentacle's off the ground. <laughs> so it's off the ground. <laughs> So you're looking at the abundance that this, this new pinnacle is going to start, this ace of pinnacle is going to give you. It's going to get things moving, you know, in the right direction. You've been balancing a lot of things with this two of pinnacle, a lot of energy, a lot of time, a lot of uh, challenging things, you know, have been going on with this two of pinnacle. It's been kind of rocky, but uh, you're on, you're smooth sailing and on your way to getting out of that storm, you know, getting out of that storm and getting that wish fulfillment to come through. Uh, that fresh breeze of fresh air and and here it goes, you know with the four cups You're contemplating on do I take it? Do I take what the universe is handing me with this ace of pinnacle? Is there something better? Is there something more? No, take the goddamn pinnacle. <laughs> Just take the goddamn pinnacle You know how Chris Rock and that girl talking about push the button push the goddamn button Well Capricorn just take the goddamn pinnacle Just take the goddamn pinnacle why? So you can get out a single card. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, that's not why. I don't want you just to do it just to be married or to get with nobody. That's because it is a great, great opportunity for you there. So at least engage in the opportunity that you have coming. Okay. Spirit Source Energy. Let's clarify the let's clarify the pinnacle. The Knight of Pinnacle Spirit Source Energy for Capricorn. What about this Knight of Pinnacle? What does Capricorn need to know? This is someone very uh, coming in, like wanting to marry you. You know it. Look at there, Will of Fortune, Spirit Source Energy. Who is this Knight of Pentacles? Spirit Source Energy. Who is this Knight of Pentacles? What does this Knight of Pentacles want? The Capricorn. What is the Knight of Pentacles intentions? Whoa! Look at them. Look at them intentions. Whoa! 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 Baby, look at that. Your Knight of Pentacle, baby, want a long-term relationship uh -oh, with you. And they want a new beginning in love. They are looking for a new beginning. They are looking for a new partner. A new partner in crime, baby. A new let's talk and let's, let's work this out, baby. Let's work whatever this is we got going. Let's make it work and see eye to eye. Baby, this is duality. 
they want a partnership with you, a long-term partnership and marriage with you. Mm. They want to pour all their love out too, baby. Look at him. They want to pour all that love out on somebody. Ooh, Lord. Spirit source energy. What is the intentions of this Ace of Cups? Spirit source energy of this person for for Capricorn. Spirit source energy. What are their person inten intentions? Oh, baby, they see you as somebody they can confide in. That they can just look at that. It's still under there. They see you as somebody they can confide in. They can trust. They see you as a person that has a lot of wisdom, a lot of knowledge, a lot of sacred knowledge. Uh, you know, they see you as a key to the universe to unlock the universe. And baby, they see you as the one that can unlock the universe and give, give them this new uh, beginning, this new beginning, this ace of cups, this new love that they've been wanting for so long. Oh, we nine of swords, spirit source energy. Let's, what is with this nine of swords for Capricorn? What does Capricorn need to know about this? Now, see, let me show y'all where this went. All my cards are flying out over where they want to really be. So, let me see what this is. See, the king of wands, baby, he wants to throw down in the bedroom, he wants to get physical, he wants to put the wand down, baby. He coming to get the high priestess. You best to trust, believe it. He done thought about it. Look at there. He done sat there and contemplated about it. He is coming to profess his passion and love for you. Okay. For you, Capricorn. This is King of Wands. This is a leader. This is somebody you ain't got to beg, baby, to do a dead gum thing, baby. This is a protector. This is someone that is able to overcome so many obstacles and challenges that come across their path you know with calmness with ease with direction baby Ooh, this king is on fire for real you better ask somebody if you don't know now you freaking know okay spirit source energy clarify this nine of swords spirit source energy clarify this nine of swords what does capricorn need to know about this nine of swords spirit source energy What's Capricorn? Look at there, the lover's card. Spirit source energy, what is Capricorn? Oh, there we go. Ooh, it is a match made in heaven. That is the battle. That is the worry. That is the worry that, you know, this building something with someone and don't knowing if someone wants to build, that's the worry. That's where this energy and everything is going into, like, um, survival mode everybody is like feeling this energy you know this is a happy couple this is get out of your head get in your heart feel the passion feel uh the love of this union if you can get out of your head and get you know get balanced in your heart tap in and tune into this person whoever this new cup of love is you may have already met them you know and just you know see yourself building with them everybody is so wound up with this energy uh this um nine and ten sword energy eight eight sword energy right now because a lot of people don't know what to do with all this pent up energy and you just have to redirect this energy you know embrace what's going on with you if you've met a new person right and you're not with a person you met a new person then yeah embrace that person and just go with the flow just learn to go with the flow move within because this is something that is set up you know from above this is something that is universal Okay, this is an old man overlooking a young couple. Like even if it's his old life, he's thinking back on his marriage days and his long, his happiness and building a legacy, you know, and wanting more for himself and wanting financial stability for himself and his family, right? Because there's his wife, there's an old man, almost like a blessing, almost like an ancestor that has blessed this union. I call it, this is my ancestor card here, that your ancestors are watching 
you know, over you and have been always watching over you, guiding you and protecting you and leading you to each other, right? Be but you can't get there with this sworn energy. You have to move into oneness. You have to move into love. You have to move into self-care and taking care of yourself in order to experience this, this uh, Ten of Pentacles here, okay? Spirit Source Energy, that is good. Spirit Source Energy. Uh, what is the four of wands about? Look like somebody trying to go and retreat, right? And get away. Spirit source energy. What's the four of wands about? Spirit source. Oh, Lord, no, we ain't taking all them. Y'all tried to slide the whole deck out. Okay, spirit source energy. Mm -mm -mm. Spirit source energy. What is the four of wands about? Here's your jumper. The sun. Oh my bejeebus. Look at that. Look at freaking that that. Okay. Look at that. So when you hook up with this 10 of Pentacles and y'all go to work and get the building. And that sun come up, babe, it's going to be on like the crack of dawn. Okay, it's going to be on. This is good for Capricorn. Very good, very positive reading. Sun coming out, got the abundance of the universe. At, you know, at, you know, working everything out. I'm trying to figure out what is going to be the name of this. Thank you all for watching. Thank you for your likes and subscriptions. Thank you for everything, the balance. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, so. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, let me clarify this four of cups a little bit more, this contemplation. Spirit source energy for Capricorn. What about this? Let me get that. That was a jumper. Ah, that's what it's about. That's what it. Oh, yeah, that didn't seem finished right there. And look at there. There's the emperor. There is the emperor. That didn't seem finished. That's why I was like, mm, I don't think you're finished. What are you communicating about? The cups. Yeah, that's more of a emotional balance and fulfillment. You are contemplating taking that cup, but soon, you know, realize that that gave you emotional fulfillment. You know, you were able to get emotionally fulfilled or able to learn from your your lessons. Okay. You were able to learn from your lessons and move forward. Okay. So that's pretty much it now. Okay. Spirit Source Energy, that's good for you, Capricorn. Let's see what our reading is going to be. Capricorn feeling they self. That's what I need to name it, this one. <laughs> Capricorn is feeling they self like the star card and the queen of pentacles, baby. That's what I need to write this one as. It's a soulmate connection because of the Ten of Pentacles here, even though. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Thank you, Spirit Source Energy. So that's it. They don't have anything else. Um, like, subscribe, comment below. Tell me if you like it. Um, okay sun card moving things around for you yep you know what your girls say peace love and harmony because if you got peace love and harmony in the world you have peace love and harmony in yourself so peace love and harmony